therefore made the assessment that COVID-19 can be characterized as a pandemic. Special Projects Division called upon the trainers to develop better courses for our prosecutors. As I said earlier, uh, I expected a lot, and you guys, the trainers, did not disappoint. I've learned a lot, and I uh, and I'd like to make a shout out to all of the trainers who have been compassionate, understanding, and most importantly, very helpful to all the participants. Thank you very much. I can say now that I am one percent prosecutor and no turning back. I would like to thank the organizer for the tremendous learnings I and my co-participants gained. At least now we will return to our post more confident and a clearer objective in mind to represent the people of the Philippines. Thank you. But of course, how can I forget the guy with a mole on his face named Wako? to our supportive and very understanding trainers. Thank you for sharing and imparting to us your expertise in prosecution. And goodbye will always be something very hard, especially if you shared something so beautiful. And I think this is what this experience is all about. It's something so beautiful, so memorable, and it is something that we will, we will carry in our hearts for for the rest of our prosecuting journey and i'd like to personally thank all the trainers all our chiefs um, i think we all are very fortunate and i think everyone would agree that most of us really it's our goal to be like you and we wish 
we could only wish to be like our trainers and our chiefs. And we're so fortunate because uh, we get to be mentored by the people who, who embody the principles that, that we actually learn here and we, we see them live and in action. The best part is we leave here not just as good prosecutors but as good human beings carrying the good values that we have learned in this seminar. So thank you so much everyone. This is one that is made by prosecutors for prosecutors. And we are truly honored to have been called to become part of it.